Sure, he just left uh, Fiji, went to New Caledonia, and is continuing on. And right now we think that he's on track uh, with his schedule and everything appears to be uh, the way it should be. Well, we are on, on the watch 24-7, 365, not just uh, on Christmas Eve watching Santa. And we have sensors uh, starting with our north warning system uh, in the Arctic and the northern parts of Canada and Alaska. Uh, we have radars, we have satellites uh, that we can contract Santa with, but we also use those very same sensors to defend North America. And we're really well postured in order to keep a close eye on Santa, but you can imagine if we can track Santa that closely, what else we can track? Well, I think it takes him all day, and that's uh, obviously uh, working all over the world. He has an entire day to do that. He's already delivered more than a half a million gifts by our count right right now. Excuse me, up, I'm sorry, half, almost 500 million gifts already. Uh, he'll continue uh, throughout the globe. Of course, he has uh, some science and technology working for him that uh, we'd love to have uh, in the military as well. Uh, but it's pretty amazing to watch him, and uh, you look at the nine reindeer that are able to uh, propel that threat, that sled all over the world at speeds that uh, we would only dream of. Well, we let Santa go freely on his journey, and really starting all the way back in 1955 when we got the first call, uh, we were able to just use the technology we have, use the sensors that we employ 24-7, 365 to defend North America, and we use that to, in order to track Santa. But we're just helping Santa. We're helping the world understand where Santa is. Uh, of course, he's, uh, he's able to do this all on his own, and we're just providing a little additional support. Well, they can certainly give us a call. And uh, in fact, we have 1,500 volunteers that are working the phones. Uh, we also have it uh, on the internet. So if you want to go to uh, www.noradsanta.org, uh, or of course you can use Alexa, you can use your OnStar, you can use Twitter or Facebook. Uh, we're connected in uh, a multitude of ways. Uh, and we're able to provide the data on where Santa is at uh, right down to the second. Well, one of the things that we find over the years is that Santa really likes to go to houses where everybody's asleep. So we highly recommend that the kids go to bed early, uh, that they are then uh, postured when Santa comes, he can come right down the chimney, uh, deliver the gifts. Uh, so when they wake up the next morning, uh, they'll have a great Christmas. Well, thank you very much, and Merry Christmas to all.